myself, I'm the Dr. Spanglis. Hola y deja que me presente, soy el Dr. Spanglis. Well, first of all, I want to say that I'm sorry because my English is not perfect, okay? I'm from Spain and maybe I will be speaking with you with some words or phrases that are not properly correct, okay? 100% correct, but at least I think we are going to understand each other, okay? If I don't understand something or some question, I will ask you, like, please, can you repeat me? Maybe slowly, because sometimes I don't understand if you speak fast, okay? I just arrived here now and I need more time to get used to speaking English and also to listen the language, okay? It's not my mother language, so... Also, I will be translating all the time in Spanish because my assistant doesn't understand any word in English, so I have to translate everything, ok? Eh, si, sí, le, le estaba diciendo que yo no vivo aquí, no hablo inglés, entonces que si no entiendo alguna cosa, le pediré por favor que me repita más despacio, ya que el inglés no es mi lengua materna. Y bueno, que estaré traduciendo cada, cada cosa que diga en inglés en español para que tú, mi ayudante, vayas apuntando todas las notas que vamos tomando acerca del, del paciente. So this is your yearly checkup. Ok, ok, ok. Sí, bueno, está diciendo que es su chequeo rutinario anual. Estábamos hablando de eso. So first of all, and because the current situation, do you feel like you had um, fever, cough, or something like that. Okay. Okay, so lately you was feeling like you was breathing heavily, like you can't breathe normal. Si sí, dice que últimamente no ha sentido fiebre, no ha sentido digamos nada nada así pero que sí que tiene la sensación de, de respirar mal que le cuesta respirar bien ok so let me write something also my assistant I have to write so you don't have 
as I I say to my assistant that your oxygen was completely normal, 98%. So. Follow the fingers. Let 
dicho que sí a los dedos. Tiene 
necesitas oxígeno cuando realmente no puedes respirar bien y no es por ansiedad que es algo que notarías notarías hay diferencia entre un ataque de ansiedad y bueno que realmente te falta el oxígeno ok well uh, I think that you need some to take some pills for your nervous for your anxiety ok I think that you need that um, and with with it you will be completely normal because yes you have anxiety but it's not I think that it's not so worrying it's not uh, something that you need to worry about more than you are worrying now just you take your daily pill and everything will be nice with you also I recommend you to do some meditation daily meditation when you wake up and before sleep okay that's something that your head will will be grateful if you do it si sí, bueno le estoy explicando que nada le voy a enviar unas pastillas para la ansiedad, para la ansiedad unas pastillas que tiene que tomar diariamente una al día y que aparte le aconsejo que haga meditación por la mañana y por la noche que su cabeza lo va a agradecer yes 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 the pills the pills will help you but also you have to do something ok also you have to do something I mean you can't just let um, your mind control you ok I understand that we are all day watching in the news bad news bad news bad news bad news that people is dying people it's I understand, I understand it, but we can't uh, just let that news make your mind sick, okay? Just, if we are really sick, it's when we have to worry about, okay? Le estoy diciendo que no, puede, que no podemos dejar que los medios que están continuamente poniendo noticias preocupantes y malas eh, se apoderen de, de, de nuestra mente, que la preocupación al final sea lo que guíe nuestra vida, que nos tenemos que preocupar en caso de que, de que realmente estemos enfermos. Yes, because many, many people is feeling like you. Many people comes here for the, for the same reason, and finally they are completely healthy, like you are just with some anxiety that with this bill will be will be fix your problem okay um, bueno le estoy diciendo que vino mucha gente como esta persona que se siente así mal y que al final eso no es ansiedad pero que con la píldora ok 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 yes Yes, you, you just have to take one pill per day, okay, before sleep, and you will sleep like a baby, really. Sí, le estoy diciendo que tiene que tomar la píldora antes de dormir y que va a dormir como un bebé. Well, 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 that's everything for today. I hope that you feel now better, um, more careful, okay. Really, you don't have, you don't have to worry about, you don't have anything to worry about. Um, if you really feel bad or with fever, you can come here again, but please the next time, even if it is a checkup, because you lied and I saw that it's not your yearly checkup because you already came two months ago si sí, bueno estaba diciendo que venga si sí, se siente mal pero que he visto que no es su chequeo anual que vino hace dos meses ok Then... goodbye and we will see 
each other in the next 